All right, item three, public comments on items not on the agenda. Individuals are, will be allowed three minutes. It is the council's policy to refer matters raised in this forum to staff for investigation and or action where appropriate. The Brown Act prohibits council from discussing or acting upon any matter agendized pursuant to state law. And I currently see no hands raised. Okay. I I'm not seeing, I, okay, so I do one, see one. Okay, one moment. And if there's anybody else that wishes, uh, if you could please uh, raise your virtual hand and so we can uh, begin. Um, um, City Clerk, when you're ready. Stephen Seymour. Hi, it's Sandra Perez Vargas. Hi, Sandra. Hi, good evening, everyone. I want to thank our first responders uh, for all the work they've been doing, all the fires happening around us, the dangers they put themselves in. And I especially want to thank them for helping remove so many animals from those wildfires and helping protect them. Thank you. Thank you for your comments. Next, please. One moment. Next is Tim O'Brien. Tim, I'm trying to unmute you. Hi, can you hear us? Yes, I can. Can you hear me? Yes, yes. whenever you're ready. Okay, good, good evening, everyone. I um, just want to say thank you to uh, the city for um, the progress on the park, especially uh, Linda Mason, uh, for pushing this, uh, at least getting something out there, some grass, so people can, uh, you know, have a great experience in the space uh, and bring a better uh, looking area to the neighborhood. Um, I really appreciate um, your hard work on that, Linda, and uh, Javon as well. Um, it's a great thing to see progress in the city and, um, and, and projects getting done and uh, just cleaning up the area is a great thing. Um, and just to, also we'd like to, talk about, um, I think it's on the agenda, but, but, uh, we got to help the, the businesses on the downtown, especially the restaurants that are struggling with some outside dining, possibly blocking off the street, uh, you know, one or two nights in the weekend. Um, it seems to be working for other cities and it's a great experience for the community and, uh, visitors have also come to our city. So I'd like to see that happen, um, and be highly considered. Thank you very much and have a great evening. Thank you, Tim, you as well. And next is Charisma Schwartzberg. Hi. Hi, Hi. Whenever you're ready. I'm ready. Thank you so much, uh, uh, City Clerk. Um, I wanted to say, uh, first of all, thank you to um, Linda Mason for the email you sent uh, a group of us um, appealing a, a tower from Ryzen um, that's being planned in the San Bruno neighborhood. I also wanted to thank an email from um, Rico Medina and a phone call from Michael Salazar. Um, I wanted to just bring to your attention, um, council members, that I am concerned that some of the resolutions that the city has approved in 2009, I believe, resolution 2019, um, are not being adhered to um, during the appeal for the CB CBR. And so I wanted to see if after every appeal, if there's any checks um, done by the city council to make sure that those um, resolutions are being um, adhered to. Um, for example, um, some of these poles, you know, are in wooded uh, residential areas. And I believe, you know, it has to mimic the background. It's what's being listed in the resolutions. Uh, I think more design um, uh, changes might probably be needed on that. Um, and I also wanted to um, bring to your attention that um, it seems like, you know, the appeals process was being rushed. And I understand that in the ordinance, um, only the uh, the city manager is able to approve, um, you know, the final appeal. Um, if there's 
you know, any way that, you know, the city council can maybe have a check on and balance on that, because we want to make sure, you know, as we um, have these, you know, telecommunication companies go into our city, you know, that they don't, um, you know, kind of destroy the, the appearance and the beauty of, of San Bruno. And so I just wanted to make to to bring that up. And I wanted to thank you for um, letting me speak today. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Schwartzberg, and thank you for being here and uh, sharing your, your views and comments. Thank you. Uh, is there, I've not seen anybody else in the queue at this time. No, I do see one call-in listener, and for that person, um, I just want to clarify, you can press star nine if you have a comment to make. But I do not see any other hands raised. Okay, 